before we start, I just wanted to say that the whole point of this video is to find and report cheaters and blatantly toxic people in ways that you may not know about or in scenarios where they change their name and you're having trouble finding their profile. If you use Steam and play online multiplayer games, you are bound to run into cheaters or harassers. And in this video, I will teach you to fairly easily track down their profile and report them to the right people. Everything I'm about to tell you would have saved me a lot of time when I ran into a cheater in Dead by Daylight. He changed his name, he changed his URL, he changed pretty much everything. And with the help of my stream, we were able to track him down and message a community mod and get him reported and hopefully banned from the game. Also note that having video footage of the cheater slash harasser or some sort of screenshot will help a lot in the situation. In my situation, I was lucky because I was streaming and I had very clear footage of what was happening. So having either of those as evidence will help a lot in the process. One of the easiest ways to find a cheater or a toxic player that you have recently played with is just open up your Steam overlay, which is Shift Tab by default, go to View Players, and then click Recent Players. But as you can tell on my screen, it doesn't always work because sometimes it doesn't update the most recent players. So I'm going to give you another method to finding somebody with a specific name if that doesn't work. Another way to find their profile is to press Shift Tab, which is the default Steam overlay hotkey and go to community and once that opens up on the right hand side there should be a search bar that says find people click there and what you want to do is type in parentheses their exact name not too sure if it has to be the same capital capitalizations but that'll help a lot so put parentheses their name however it's spelled in parentheses and that'll Define the search much more so Steam can find their specific name instead of people with certain parts of their name all over Steam. So it'll it'll cut out hundreds of thousands of different people. Now at this point, you want to start looking for their name, their profile. This part can be tricky as there will still be a handful of people with the same exact or similar name. Check the profiles that pop up and see if the recently played game is the same as the one you found them in. If so, you may have a match. If none of them do, check player profiles with different names than the one you searched up that is in the list of profiles Steam gave you. Sometimes if you search up someone's recent name before they change their name, it will still pop up on the list of usernames that you searched for, even though it's completely different. For example, the name of the person in my game that I'm showing you in the, you know, the background, his name is White Pigs, you know, obviously racist because American is fat, whatever the fuck. Anyway, um, but when I searched up White Pigs in the find people search, Someone with the name Killer Sucks appeared, not White Pigs. I checked their profile, their profile was private, and I checked their recent uh, names or their past names, and White Pigs was there, so I obviously had a match. And even though his name wasn't White Pigs still, I searched up White Pigs, and his profile still came up in the search. Killer Sucks Pigs. Yep, it's this guy. Found him. Found him, boys. This guy right here, White Pigs. Now if you manage to find their profile, what you want to do is, at the top of the window, you'll see a URL, and at the end of the URL, you'll see a name, or numbers, or whatever they decided to make their URL. You want to copy all of that. Now once you copy that, go to a site called steamid.eu. Once you get there, in the middle, around the middle top area, on the left side of the screen, it should say search players. You want to paste their, the end of the URL in there, and it will find their profile, what all their past names were, when they changed them, what their Steam ID is, and this way, they can't they can't change anything to get away. And at this point, you're pretty much successful. All you need to do is find a community manager or a mod or somebody. Like in the discussions, they usually have community managers for games. Like for example, Dead by Daylight. I found a couple. One of them didn't respond. The other one responded immediately. I showed them evidence of the cheater. I sent him the the profile but at first it wasn't available because he changed his url one of my viewers managed to find his uh his steam id by like backtracking his old name and looking it up on this website steamid.eu and it confirmed it was him i linked him the page and hopefully things get taken care of from there and hopefully this will help you on your way to just reporting bad people i mean it seems like meh why waste time doing this, but 
it, it, it really helps if you go out of your way and to report bad people and report cheaters because if no one does it, then there's, there's nothing's going to happen to them and they're going to stay. So I hope this helped you. I really do. If you have any trouble, just comment below and I'll try to help you out. It's a fairly simple process. Just find their profile, find their uh, the end of their URL, go to the website, look it up, and bam, you have their CMID. It's set. So thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope this helps you out if you run into problems with people in the future. Thanks for watching again and feel free to like or dislike or do whatever you want to do to the video if you enjoyed and this was helpful or not or whatever. Have a nice day and I'll see you guys next time. This guy's definitely cheating. We all on the same page? Okay. I just wanted to make sure that I'm not fucking crazy.